So c- congratulations. <laughs> Thanks. What is I don't it? know if it's something to be, yeah, it's a, it's a weird thing. <laughs> to be celebrated for this? It just seems, it seems kind of funny because most races, it's, uh, it's, you know, there's so many factors going on within a, within a stage race that, you know, uh, for some riders like myself, the overall might not be a factor, but in the tour, something like the, the last place riders is something that is at somewhat of a, another spectacle in itself. Hmm. What does it feel like to have finished in last place? <laughs> well, more, I guess more importantly for myself was just to have finished. I had some, I had four crashes during the tour and yeah, it really takes its toll. In a three-week stage race, you expend a lot of energy. In the first week, you really pay for it in, in the final. So the last three, four days, they were, were in the Alps on some really difficult courses, and I struggled like no one else. So I guess more more than anything, I was really happy to finish in Paris. But to end up in the Lantern Rouge was, uh, I guess, just another little bonus. <laughs> Did your teammates get you a, like an honorary medal or anything to celebrate? <laughs> no, it, it's just, it's more something that uh, at the end of such a, an epic journey, we all just, we have a good laugh about it. And, and uh, you know, I never even expected, I didn't know I was there until uh, our director one morning, he, he kind of brought it up in the meeting and we all, <laughs> we all had a good laugh about it. But yeah, it's, it's you know, I, I guess in the past, some riders have tried to, you know, compete each other for, you know, maybe get dropped towards the last 5K of the race or something to lose more time. But I, that was nothing going on in my head. I was just focusing on on making it to Paris. This is Day 6. Day 6. Like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter. We're at CBC Day 6.